This is an early look at your Friday forecast. I'm Chief Meteorologist Nicholas Ferreri. We are starting off the day warm, especially in comparison to recent mornings with temperatures around 50. The problem, we have rain falling. That rain will be heavy at times. We even have a severe thunderstorm chance on our Friday, but that's going to hold off until late at night into early Saturday. Wind gusts continue to pick up. So gusts during the day on our Friday up to around 40 miles per hour. By nighttime, we're around 50 miles per hour. Now this rain comes through in rounds, so at lunchtime, we're dry, one round of rain there moving off to the east. Mid-50s at noon, high temperatures around 60. That happens around 4 o'clock. Then we're going to hover around 60 all throughout the evening. More rain and thunderstorms getting ready to track in. So heavy rain, thunder, lightning, some gusty winds at moments. We get into late Friday night. Again, this is when the severe weather potential will be the highest, when a cold front passes through the area. It's going to rush through from west to east in the window between 11 o'clock Friday night to 1 in the morning Saturday. Temperatures, which are around 60 as that front moves through, will quickly drop as cold air follows. So by 8 in the morning Saturday, we're down to the low 40s. We'll get colder and colder as Saturday progresses. We'll be in the 30s in the afternoon. You can see rain and snow showers at times. Saturday morning, wind gusts around 50 miles per hour gradually decreasing as we go through the day. Those winds are going to add a big chill to the air as our temperatures fall. So get ready for a wintry Saturday around here. Sunday, though, will be better. So our severe weather threats Friday night into early Saturday morning. Winds are the highest threat. Hail, the medium threat. Flooding and tornadoes, not zero, but is the lowest on our scale. Take a look at your exclusive 10-day forecast here. Sunday, you can see the improvement. Sunshine and 53. Monday, 64. Tuesday, 66. Rain chances on those days. Wednesday, just a slight chance at rain. The bigger headline there, our first 70-plus day of the year with that high of 71. Thursday, though, we're back down to the 50s. 51 staying in the 50s to round out next week. That's your latest forecast.